Hey kids, it's Mrs. Davis from Happy Place to Grow and I am here today to read you a really silly winter story. It's called, There Was a Cold Lady Who Swallowed Some Snow. It's written by Lucille Calandro and illustrated by Jared Lee. All right, we've got two things that we're gonna focus on, of course, when we're listening to the story, we're going to enjoy it because it's really funny. But I also want you to pay close attention to the order that the cold lady swallows these things because I'm going to need your help putting the events back in order. All right, let's get started. There was a cold lady who swallowed some snow. I don't know why she swallowed some snow. Perhaps you know. There she is. Surp, surp. There was a cold lady who swallowed a pipe. She wasn't the type to gulp down a pipe. Hmm, but she did anyway. Gobble, gobble. She swallowed the pipe to warm her ten toes that tickled and tingled from layers of snow. I don't know why she swallowed some snow. Perhaps you know. Tickle, tickle. Tingle, tingle. Look at this page. It's really dark. Hmm, I wonder why. Oh, yeah. She swallowed snow and she swallowed a pipe. And those things are inside her stomach and there's no light bulb in there. No wonder it's dark. Let's see what she swallows next. There was a cold lady who swallowed some coal. What was her goal when she gobbled the coal? Hmm, crunch, crunch. Yeah, it would be crunchy. <laughs> That's really inappropriate. Good thing this is a fiction story. She swallowed the coal to keep her pipes glow. She swallowed the pipe to warm her ten toes that tickled and tingled from layers of snow. Well, I don't know why she swallowed some snow. Perhaps you know. There they are, snow a pipe, some coal. And she thinks those things are yummy. Hmm. Whoa, she opened really wide for this thing. There was a cold lady who swallowed a hat. Imagine that. A black brimmed hat. That's a fancy one. Whoa. A lot of things floating in her stomach. She swallowed the hat before she froze. She swallowed the coal to keep her pipes glow. She swallowed the pipe to warm her ten toes that tickled and tingled from layers of snow. Well, I don't know why she swallowed some snow. Perhaps, hmm, you know. There was a cold lady who swallowed a stick. Oh, that would definitely hurt. Very scratchy. A long brown branch. What a pick. Crack, crunch. Whoa, that's a lot of stuff floating in her stomach. Hmm, are you figuring out why she swallowed these things? She swallowed the stick to push down the snow. She swallowed the hat before she froze. She swallowed the coal to keep her pipes glow. She swallowed the pipe to warm her ten toes that tickled and tingled from layers of snow. I don't know why she swallowed some snow. Perhaps you know. 
I know you can figure this out. Hey, let's see what she swallows next. There was a cold lady who swallowed a scarf. A long, striped scarf. <laughs> she tried not to barf. Now that's funny. She swallowed a scarf because it was so cold. She swallowed a stick to push down the snow. She swallowed a hat before she froze. She swallowed the coal to keep her pipes glow. She swallowed the pipe to warm her ten toes that tickled and tingled from layers of snow. I don't know why she swallowed some snow. Perhaps you know. Hey, look all that look at all that stuff floating there. We've got the snow, we've got the pipe and the coal. We've got the hat, the stick, and now that striped scarf. Hmm, let's see what happens next. Now, this cold lady had quite enough. She was done. So she thought, and she thought, and she came up with a plan. See that light bulb? She's thinking about something. Let's see what she's thinking about doing. Oh boy. She hiccuped twice. Hiccup, hiccup, and out popped. Whoa, that was forceful. Let's see what popped out. I bet you know. There goes all that stuff. <laughs> With two hiccups, she got it out. A snowman. And she's really excited about it. I guess she feels better now that the stuff's out. Oh, and he is a cute one, don't you think? Oh, that was a funny story. And definitely fiction. So, let's do our second job. We, our first job was to listen and enjoy. I sure did. Now, let's put the story parts back together. Let's do some teamwork. I'm going to need your help. We're going to be thinking about the first thing she swallowed to the last thing. All right, let's take a look at my board over here. And hey, if we can't remember what she swallowed, we can always look back in the book. That's a great strategy. If you have to answer a question or you're trying to put a story back in order from the beginning to the end, you can always look back in the story to find the answer or check to see if you're correct. All right, let's get started. Okay, here we go. Here are the things that the old, the, I almost said old lady, the cold lady swallowed. Okay, let's think for just a minute. Oh yeah, I know what she swallowed first. I know you do too. Yeah, it was the snow. Let's grab the word snow and the snowball. I'm going to stick it up here. It's the first thing she swallowed. Now, what did she swallow second? All right. Hmm. Here's all my items. Oh yeah, it was the pipe. I know you guessed that one. So first she swallowed the snow and then she swallowed the pipe. Now, what did she swallow third? Hmm. Oh yeah, she swallowed the coal to keep her pipes glow. Well, that makes sense. That one was an easy one to sequence. Okay, what did she swallow next? What was her fourth item? Hmm. We got the stick, the hat, the scarf. Oh yeah, it was the hat. Was the fourth thing she swallowed. Now we've got two more things. We've got the scarf and we've got the stick. And once we find the fifth thing, the sixth thing will be easy because it'll be the only one left. Hmm. Hmm. Oh yeah, it was the stick. Remember she swallowed the stick to push down the snow. And then finally, she swallowed that scarf as she tried not to barf. So let's review our sequence. 
first the snow. That makes sense. That's the most important thing to swallow if you're going to build a snowman. Then the pipe, the coal, the hat. The fifth thing she swallowed was the stick. And then finally, she swallowed the scarf. And wow, she swallowed those things. After that, she got a bright idea. She came up with a plan. She hiccuped twice and out popped all those things and they formed a snowman. And that's how the story ended. Oh, I am so glad that you helped me put the, or, the story back in order from the first thing she swallowed to the last thing she swallowed. Hey, teamwork really helps. And we didn't even have to go back in the story, but we could have if we needed to. All right, I hope you really enjoyed listening to this story. And I do appreciate you helping me put the story back in order. All right, until our next fun story time together, as always, keep reading and have a good one.